Hi, my name is Dr. Rinde Faderikpo. I'm with Doctors Express and today I wanted to talk a little bit about um, otitis externa, also known as a swimmer's ear and uh, some people just call it an earache. Otitis externa is, um, is basically you can be recognized by someone that has ear pain, some ear drainage, um, and also some possibly some problems with moving the jaw. Otitis externa is not always um, seen as um, an a external ear like this one, but it's actually inside the ear. And, uh, but it's, it's, out, it's a part of the ear that's a little bit closer to the outside. A lot of times um, when you have this, it might be related to having a lot of water in your ear or when you've been swimming in, in dirty water or water that is not so clean. Also, it can be influenced by having put in toothpicks or, or Q-tips in your ear. And also, if you have any kind of sickness that can sometimes cause you to feel to have a low immune system and not be able to fight off infections. Um, if you have any of those symptoms we talked about, you should go see your doctor and the way you're diagnosed with the otitis externa or swimmer's ear is by your doctor actually looking in your ear with a machine called an otoscope to see the inside part of your ear. Um, usually a doctor might see some debris, you might see a little bit of drainage and uh, fluid coming out of your ear and some irritation in your ear. How it's treated is by using a topical antibiotic or some antibiotics that you put inside of your ear and also something to kind of decrease the inflammation. Your doctor might also want to clean out your ear so it's easier for the medications to work for you. Um, and after, after that, things you want to watch out for is if the symptoms don't go away, you keep on having a lot of pain in your ear or you have more drainage, you would like to go back and see your doctor. Um, if you have any other questions, you should go and see your primary care provider or go to doctorsexpress.com to find a center near you.